Hello my crafty friends, it's Jelly Bean, and I wanted to come on here real quick and show y'all something that I made using a couple tutorials that I've seen, or process videos, whatever you want to call them. First of all, Wagman 510 showed us how to make the triple layered um, tassel, and she used paper to do it. And I made some, this was the first one that I made. And I used a like jute twine for the thing and then I was like, yeah, I don't really like that. So I changed it, but can y'all see what I made it out of? I made it out of crepe paper, y'all. <laughs> I think these turned out so cute. I am, um, I will link Alicia's video where she tells how to make the little tassels down in the description box. But then I use gold thread for the rest of them. But I think they turned out so cute. My washi tape's coming undone at the top of this one. I'm gonna have to glue it. But I made, um, I used, this is the Hobby Bobby crepe paper. And on the very top one, I fold, I folded in half and glued it. And, uh, that, and left the bottom one, the original length of the crepe paper. And then this one I cut off to the length that I wanted. So this is... A green and a pink that I made and sometimes the video really doesn't capture a good look at it this is a pink and white one that I made so what I'll do at the end of the video I'll I'll put a couple pictures so you can see them real good and then I made a double layer one with some green and pink and I was just kind of, these are like prototypes, y'all. I was just trying to see if it was going to work with the crepe paper. And I think they turned out really cute. Now, I haven't done any tassels before, so this was kind of new to me. And then, um, I took the crepe paper and I applied it to another tutorial that we've all seen. Which was the flower tutorial that... Alicia told us about that crafting with Lily did. Lily did the tutorial for the paper flowers and Alicia made some and I made two out of crepe paper. Aren't those cute y'all? I think they turned out cute. Now I used the stamens in the center but I did just like Lily's tutorial and I cut a strip about 12 inches long and I fringed it. I don't have fringe scissors or anything so I just cut it by hand you know well you cut by hand anyway but y'all know what I mean and laid the stamen down and rolled it up uh, around the stamen and I made a yellow one and a pink one. Isn't that cute? I'm making little sets so I'm making some flowers and tassels and stuff to put in a little set. I'll show you all the sets when I get done, but I thought these turned out really cute. Now, I'll go ahead and link Lily's tutorial down below as well. This first one that I did, I didn't put the stamen in, but it's the mint green with white around the edge. It needs a little bit more, I think, and something in the center, so this was kind of a prototype, but... I think they turned out really cute and I just wanted to come on here and share those with y'all and let you know use your crepe paper it's cheap <laughs> but anyway I hope y'all like that I'll be back later with maybe something new who knows y'all have a crafty day don't forget to give me a thumbs up and I'll see you real soon bye for now